So my cousin and I were driving in a red car, nostalgic of an old Honda. And we were driving in the middle of nowhere. All of a sudden, it took us by surprise. The ocean was right in front of us. And I let her know, look, we're driving into the body of water. And she laughed. We looked at each other, opened our doors, and locked eyes, cue for let's swim. And we swam at full speed at full fierce. We swam all the way to the shore into this bay looking area. And on the way there, there were some people that were struggling swimming, but they weren't drowning. And there were some mermaids, male and female. And it was interesting, the feeling that I got when I woke up, it was a feeling of conquering. It was a feeling of uh, adversity and going through a tough swim. And you know the saying, sink or swim, sink or swim. We have two choices. We can sink or swim. We looked at the opportunity that we had. We could either drown and give up or we can swim and give it all we got. And we had so much energy in us and we had so much power. We went all the way. And I don't know what the meaning of this dream is but it encouraged me when I woke up it encouraged me a lot and as um, I've been spending these days worshiping God more than ever and there's been so many trials just hit left and right but there's so many praise reports things that I have been worried about that God has answered. I'm just so blessed that my God truly has my back. Truly every worry that I have, he tells me, don't worry about it, I got you. This reassurance that the Lord gives us, that he has us in the palm of his hands, and there's nothing in this world that would ever snatch us away from him. I'm encouraged today as I hear these ocean waves and you see the water and it looks so calm but as the waves come through and they crash you can sense the power in them too and just that this body of water that we see is just a glimpse of so much water that's on this earth so abundant there's so much abundance that we don't even know about last night I was um, listening to this worship song and one of the verses in the song said I just can't get past your goodness I just can't get past your kindness and I was just dwelling and relishing on those verses. And today I had a praise report. And so for those that know me, know what it is. And I'm just so blessed. God is really, really good. And when we think for a moment that uh, he's forgotten our prayers, he hasn't never has, never will. He's good all the time. All the time.